Star effect will generate radial turning stitches in step, satin, and fancy fills. Open the effects menu, select the object, and place a check mark in front of star fill. Select apply. Now let's zoom in toward the center of this object and you can see that the stitches are fairly intense at the center of the hole. A lot of times it's best to lessen the density with this effect. To do this, go to object properties and by clicking this button at the bottom of the effects dialog box that will open up object properties. I'm going to lessen the density quite a bit to 0.9 and I'll click on apply. Now let's go back to the effects and you'll notice that underlay is activated. That's one thing that we'll want to deactivate. So let's go ahead and turn off underlay and you'll see this line of stitches and this is called a traveling stitch and we need to get rid of this. So to get rid of that, I'll go to the Others tab, place the check mark in front of Travel on Edge, and click Apply. This forces the travel stitch to travel along the outside. Now we can make some other changes as well. I'm going to return to the Star and Wave Fill, and notice that you can change the whole width and the whole height. So let's change those both to 5 millimeters and apply that. I can make other changes as well, and I make those changes by clicking on Reshape. One of the things that can be done is that the hole can be moved. You'll notice that there are three yellow squares, and if I click on that center one and move it to another location, now the all the stitches will radiate from that new hole. I can also visually change the size of the hole with these squares that are on either side of the center. I can also take this hole and move it off the object and notice the effect of that. So have some fun experimenting with the star effect.